Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mugglelover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Equestria War, playing as, well, of course, Equestria. So, hope you're all having a great day. For right now, let's address a comment or a few. So, I asked you guys yesterday, should we do maintain traditional autonomies or centralized power on authority? So, if we do traditional autonomies, that's basically the system that we did for the past thousand years. Or we just go with centralized power on authority, so just in case we ever get attacked again, we'll be ready for, you know war and frankly I don't like minus zero percent consumer goods um, yeah free repairs okay efficiency or attention is okay but resource efficiency gain max factories in the state construction speed it's not great but I just gotta go with authority you know it may not reflect my beliefs in real life or maybe that actually does but if you can get more authority I'm usually going to select that option, but not always, not always. But while the old decentralized model has served Equestria faithfully for over a millennium, the war has revealed to us truly how loose our union is. We must solidify our nation for the future because we might just end up going to war with someone eventually because... Oh, well, not aggression pact. Hmm. Some people might have some of my states that I have cores on. And while we have good... Oh, actually, we kind of have mixed relations. We kind of like them. They don't like us. Not paid licenses. Deponia. Deponia. Come on, Deponia. I'll give you, like, three days. If you don't give me my goods, there's no more goods going to you. All right, we've given you three days. Don't tell me I can't do that. Strength and unity. Also, apparently, uh, one person left a comment saying yesterday, any griffin who takes Griffinheim can reform the Griffonian Empire. So thank you for that information. I did not know that. Even though the border gore looks really, really bad here. Really, really bad. Anyways, uh, someone also commented, why do people choose the higher level text or the text for excavation at the later levels like Let's see, let's show it up on screen so it makes more sense, because my explanations aren't very good. Why do we choose these texts, these excavation, you know, texts, instead of the first one? Usually it's just because the later texts have decisions with them. I guess in this mod, the earlier texts have the decisions with them, but in other mods, the later texts have decisions with them. At least that's how I usually see them as. So, there's that. We got some more stuff here. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh la la. Depth charge flow, that might be useful. Cool. So right now we're at peace. We're centralizing power and authority. Tra transitional government. Cool. We'll get to a piece of ponies. Faith in the harmonic empire. Yes, please. Harmony isn't what it used to be. Amen. The bastion of harmony. So we get foreign subversive activities. D division attack on core territory. Just a little bit more. A little more construction speed for a few things. In the arsenal of harmony. That looks pretty good. Send volunteers, tension limit, more volunteer divisions, plus one. We can build factories just slightly faster. Cool. Requires strike back. Oh. Uh, very good. What does that say? One of the following must be true. It has a war goal against Equestria. It's just a fucking war against Equestria. Cool. Now, we got a couple, two more divisions. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Come under Swift Wing. And I, really, I do want to go to war with Stallion Grad, just because we don't like potential enemies near us. We really don't like them. Improved armor. Uh, probably not. Uh, doesn't look too bad. What do we want? Better artillery? Yes, please. Happy 1014, my friends. Happy 1014. Just in case. Oh, you know what? We could probably cancel the non-aggression pact. Oh, how clan is gone. They were puppeted or annexed. I didn't really read that. They've got quite a few divisions, but so do we. What is our spy agency like? We have one a spy. What are we building up? A lot of infrastructure, that's nice. Daybreak, good. We can wait to do that a little later. Land Doctrine is looking pretty fabulous. Uh, 10, 15, that's a little bit of two ahead of time. Sure, we'll do that. Oh. Very good. Let's do that. Throw the Pegasus, the Pegasi over there. Nice, and you'll be led by... Orion Star. Nah. Fizzle Pop Berry Twist. Better name. Can we go to war with these guys? Oh, uh, no. I don't think we can. Oh, I mean, technically, yeah, we can. But I didn't realize there's a northern block up here. Huh. If that's the case, Field Marshal Time, a Bernard Hofgonnery. Welcome to the family. 
And let's grab the recovery rate as well. Any orders you have should come here. That'll be good. Perhaps we should make the entire continent ours. Here, mechanize. Yeah, maybe we want some mechanize eventually. That'd be kind of fun. We need more military factories, though. Why am I making so much infrastructure when we need military factories? Because we want to build infrastructure to get more military factories. But I do have a cup of good equestrian green tea here with me. Pretty tasty. Let's see, anywhere else? Yeah, we really need more development around here. Holy cow. Good. We're getting a lot of naval XP. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. Oh. Caltrop DK? 19... Combat width. Um. 19. Huh. Very good, my friend. Centralized power and authority. Appease the ponies. The final step to reaffirming the monarchy, monarchy's legitimacy and the equestrian union is to lend our ear to the people and pay them more mind in the future. Reforms are to be made post haste. Post haste, right? Post haste. Usually I don't say that. Hmm. Yeah, 40 combat with infantry. Look at those things. Mm, love it. Throw on some mage companies as well. Yes. I think that'd be amazing. Oh, no. Oh, actually, good. Stalin Gradient Operative Captured. This could be worn. Felixia Sugochenkov. Peppermint. We have ways of making you talk. That's like I have to do that, so. Motorized magical equipment's looking pretty darn good. We are making a couple of those divisions, too. Government cipher schools, I might c consider shifting my production from artillery to magical equipment. Or just actually motorized rocket artillery, I mean. Maybe. We do have enough. Go and do that first. Get more tanks, get some more carrier naval bombers, get some tactical bombers too. Death charge thrower, very nice. Cruisers, yeah, let's get some better cruisers going. Nice. Could use a couple more. Screens, capital ships, just bigger navy overall. You guys are looking pretty okay. Yeah, looking pretty good. And actually, let's make sure we put you where we need to put you. I don't remember if this is, I made these guys my puppets or not yet. Good. And I don't want to go to war until we have that transitional government put away. Nice. Good. Awesome. Radio interception group. Yeah, we can do that one. That's fine. Next. Become a spy master. Absolutely. We're going to need a few more ponies. And we got one. Make it two. And garrison regiments. We need to actually increase you to 10 combat with. Yep, we definitely need more army XP. And we get some every day, so that's okay. Region wide integration might be good as well. Appease the ponies. As soon as I saw that word lavender, I instantly thought of Lavender Town from Pokemon. Hmm. Do we have a right ER over here? That'd be good to put it over here just because we might need to see what's in the water sometime. Uh, and faith in, har in a harmonic empire it has been a tumultuous year for Equestria. I know I said, that, I said that word wrong, but whatever. The monarchy and all its ancient wisdom has proven it is still ever more capable to adapt and evolve itself and the nation for the future. Long live the princesses of Equestria. Yes. Nice. Look at that. Political power. Diamond Mountain. Good. Hmm. Air Force Department. Very good. Very good. Do that as well. Ah, another spy can be recruited. Flash Colt. Demolition expert. Duke Solar. I like that. Duke Solar. Go ahead and start doing stuff here. Good, good, good. Nice. Go ahead and do that. That'll be fine. Just make sure that everything we use is pretty good, pretty high quality. And, oh, we need some more steel. Oh no. Passive defense. Can I change this? No, I cannot. How disappointing. That's why I'm going to continue building a ton of infrastructure. Just tons and tons and tons. Disperse industry, good. 
to help with infrastructure, we're going to get more construction as well. Ooh, that is... Hmm. Bad supply. I don't like this. Ooh, that's really not good. If that's the case, I, I'm not keeping you there then. Come over here, where the infrastructure is pretty good. Longsword, Guardian, Governance is okay. Eventually, I do want to build up infrastructure everywhere, so... That'd be kind of nice, kind of good. Get more resources. And... Let me, I'll stop in just a second. Boom. Well, you might as well do that, why not? We're going to get some nuclear reactors, that'd be great. Oh yeah, definitely build up infrastructure here too. Conveniently ignoring the south for now, even though that's in some regards maybe better to build up. Just because they probably won't get taken over anytime soon, but I could be wrong. There goes some nuclear reactors. Good. Air stuff. Yeah, definitely get better planes. What am I doing? A lot of times I forget to even build up planes, so. Another one was captured! Kalina Mikhailov. Hmm. I like the face of that pony, but anyways, Tiny. We have made making her talk, yep. Yeah, absolutely. Lucia has capitulated, cool. We don't have a lot of pony power, we should probably get some more later on. Increase our conscription. But in time, my dear citizens, in time. Ah, uh, Equestria will be known as a land of the best infrastructure in the world. High speed rail, maybe. Uh, well, that's good. I'm not going to do the next one yet, just so we can have a little bit more time with those civilian factories. So we can build stuff up a little more quickly, just for now. And I know we have a, an operative. Good, alright. Nice. So I'm just throwing all my stuff here. You guys are 40 combat width with these rocket artilleries. And then you guys are 20 combat width with... Regular artillery, so... What the heck? Magical infantry, which I am trying to make. I'm making more on hooves divisions. Hmm. I need mage companies, but I want logistic companies as well. I can take out field hospitals. Huh. Because I want to make these guys 40 combat with... Forty-one, forty combat with imp. Well, eventually, of course, eventually. Another operative. Oh, flash solar. Uh, yeah, yeah. We kind of have to do that. Ah, oh, yeah, that's good. Can we spy anywhere else in Stalingrad? No. Hmm. So be it. Another division. Julie, good. Let's see, artillery is doing really well. We have plenty of infantry equipment. Yeah, we need just more military factories for now. Lower that by five. Good. Now we need more aluminum. We need more resources in general. Resources. 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 We definitely build up more infrastructure. Fry win. Good. Advanced artillery upgrades. Great. Anti-air, might be good to do. Rocket artillery sounds like a lot of fun. Anti-tank, eh, I can kind of ignore that for now. Tactical bombers, it is. Ah, magical infantry. I'm just going to throw everyone just right there. That's fine for now. Mm. It's easiest to strike. Probably near the coast. That's over a river. How strong are their divisions? Not that strong. Good. Harmony isn't what it used to be. The years of trials and tribulations, at least politically, is finally over. A question the harmony that we hold within it is finally secured again. Even if it's not the same as we began with, we must now look outward. Yes. Where are you? Oh, I gave him words over there. That makes sense. There you go. And going to war with these guys would actually prove fairly useful for more army XP. That could be really good. Whoa. Now that's a big Griffonian Empire. 
Oh, you guys are fighting each other. Nice. Nice. Infiltration in depth. We are done with our land doctrine. Very good. Nukes. I'd love to get nukes, but we got to wait on that. Get some of that as well. Fuel is looking amazing right now as well. But you know what we are lacking here? Lacking something fierce. Your bases. Just in case. And each one uses... How many crystals do we got? Oh, we don't have any. We can't... Ooh, that's not good. 28. Hold on. Magical equipment. Actually, medium tanks do that first. Ah, I see. We gotta lower that. It's costing me too many crystals. I don't have those crystals. For now, that's fine. I'm gonna build one thingamabob. But I will not be able to produce it because I have no crystals. That sucks. Let's see. Equipment and production. Oh, low pony power, yeah. Passive defense, that's good. Even more passive defense construction. Five, great. Extract. We got a ton of political power. Water towns is capitulated, cool. Region wide integration. Military training, yes. Awesome. Very good. Super Marine Spitfire, awesome as well. It's almost 1015. I guess we get the next level of carrier planes. Magical weapons, carrier fighters. Yeah, we're going to need some more stuff there. Definitely more aluminum. Make resistance contacts. Wow. Coordinated strike. I am the spy master, of course. Well, once this is done, done with transitional government, we can probably hopefully go back to war without any interruption. Actually, this will only be the second war we've actually been a part of. So, the Bastion of Harmony. With our newfound Harmony and Hoof, we have to defend it with all our might, and unless we lose it to some outside invader, Equestria will prevail. Rocket technology. Passive defense, cool. They get a research slot, better men of logistics. Revolution, they went with help them. Territorial disputes. Griffin colony agent. No! Rapid amethyst! No! Our town. Simplified bureaucracy, which they didn't, weren't able to go down that path. Oh, that sucks. Well, uh, oh, they're improving relations. What, what, what if we don't like communists? Oh, they, oh, they took that area over, huh? Oh, this area falls. I'm not, I don't really care, to be honest with you. Uh, heavy ships. I want a better carrier. You know what? We're not even going to come here yet. That'd be fine. The full might of this enemy nation. If that's the case, you know what? I'm going to shorten the line a little bit. Crystal Empire. I wish I kept him as a puppet, but that was my fault. That was my mistake. Wow, supply is really bad down here. We gotta make that better. There we go. Like that. Good, yeah. Let's let's make sure we make the magical plateau a little better. There we go. Magical plateau. You could probably do better there. Definitely better here. Better there. And the rest of that can wait. Okay. Good, good, good. It's only one more factory and it's done instantly. Great. Yeah, supplies really bad around here. Holy cow. Regiment Garrison. We can probably plump you up a little more. The River Republic requests aid. Currently at war, the River Republic has sent a diplomatic mission from the Riverlands requesting military support in the interest of preserving pony harmony and defending their way of life. Anything for Eastern Cousins. Yeah, that's fine. Why not? That'll be good. Royal Armor. 20 combat width. That's right. Mage Companies. Engineers. 
That's all I can afford. Hmm. Cool. Bristol. Beaufort. Naval bombers, please. Thank you. Thank you. Very full mar, cool. Strategic bombers, yeah, we're gonna need one of these for uh, purposes later on. Any other upgrades? Tactical bombers, you definitely do that. We're looking good there. Mechanized equipment will come along soon, and we have get another spy. Steel bubble gum, nice. Excavation one, great. Race tax time. Piercing, Magical Infantry Organization, Weather, ooh, Air Attack, let me go with the Weather one. Oh, look at that, oh yeah, let's get some more of this, that'd be nice, that'd be nice, good. Whole more divisions, that's okay with me. Oh, I can't justify against them, so. Democracies can't justify war goals against countries that have not generated world tension. So be it. Non aggression pact. But I can justify these guys. Huh, that's cool. Alright, let's go ahead and stop making these guys. We probably don't need these on hooves divisions anymore. That's good. So if I wanted to go to war as a democracy, who would we go to war with? Hmm. Padina? Oh, another ally with all those guys. No way. Oh. I would love to go to war with Stalingrad and the Northern Bloc, really. You know, we could probably still go to war with the Northern Bloc. Probably not do that well, though, but the Arsenal of Harmony. Perhaps the defense of this hard gained harmony is not enough. For the greater good, we must be a harmonic bulwark both at home and abroad. How strong are these guys? Uh, they are like the perfect target that I want to go to war with, but I can't go to war with them. <sighs> because they're Harmony. Darn it. Yakiakistan. Well, then they call them their allies. That might be okay. How strong are these guys? Yeah, they're a little strong. A little strong. And how about Nova Grafonia? These guys are pretty strong. Kind of like them, though. But these guys are not aligned. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Now, I wish the Crystal Empire would improve things up there. Agent captured. God dang it. Ugh. Immediately help uh, stuff up there. That'd be good. And right there, too. And maybe right there. Can I, I can't build Raider up there, which sucks. That's okay, though. Let's go rescue our operative. Go ahead. Oh, carrier's nice. Might as well get the next carrier then. You guys can stop training. Prepare. Dread League. Oh. Dark Crusade on the Octarian Order. Carriers, stuff like that. Three carriers, four carriers. Hmm. Nice, another cruiser. Well, having three carriers and four battleships with nine screens probably isn't going to be great. Well, this seems like pretty death stacky. How about their navies, actually? Naval wise, yeah, that's not good for them. They obviously don't have any. Oh, there they go. Yeah, my navy just can blow them out of the water, probably. Which would be kind of nice, you guys. There's not many of you guys here, which is fine. You guys come over there. Uh, why do you have 25 divisions there? Holy cow. Oh, you. I want you guys up here. Concentration of forces like that. It's probably a really bad idea, to be honest with you. Probably a terrible idea. Some, uh... Oh, there goes Arctur Norder. Holy cow. That was fast. Mage Company, more piercing. 
God, I wish I could make the infrastructure better. Yep, good, good, good. Nice. And happy 1015, my friends. 1015. Research speed time. Oh, look at that. New. 1011. Early swirl. Yeah, you're done making those garbage ships. Mark 3. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. That'll be fine. Yeah, that would be fine. Jackistan. Nice. So we got a little bit of while, so Arsenal of Harmony is done. And we got that one done too. Great. So the right side of the focus tree is done. Now how about we go with something else. Passive influence. That's not bad. Guarantee independence. Southern resources. I kind of like. But... Magic crypto machines. Magic can accomplish many different things and tasks, even such as inventing new electronic devices and techniques. How? No clue. It's magic, after all. Hmm. Carrier organization. That'd be good since we have our naval XP now. You guys are looking kind of. Hmm. Supply isn't great up here, and these divisions are forty combat with with some of these guys up here. So that's good. Yeah. Mage companies. I definitely need that. And logistics. Ooh. I might just get rid of support artillery for logistic companies. Attacking here is probably not a good idea. My god, these is so bad. This is so bad. Excavation 5, very good. Fuel is okay for now. We should be fine. Better radar, perhaps? Put naval bomber 2s. Yeah, I could probably use that. Maybe strategic bombers will. Keep those guys there for now. Supply-wise, we're doing pretty well on pretty much everything. We do need planes. Ah, oh, there's a carrier. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Over here. Sure, guys can hit pretty darn hard. That'd be good. Egypt white integration. Oh, this did their cipher thing. Oh, we're already on extensive conscription. Huh. Ah, more magical infantry. Well, that's nice. Cut them down. Yeah, cut them down. We don't need. We don't need really that much more for now. We might need more later on, but for now, probably not. No, it's after schools. Uh, that's fine. There you go. Little limited exports would be so nice to do. They probably have a lot of guys up here. Ship wise, how are ships doing? Another carrier. We might do stuff up here too. Hmm. It's 14 screens. Yeah, I got too many capital ships. That'll be a little better. Yeah, that's fine. Loving my carriers though. Magical crypto machines. Railways, oh, I like this one. So, quick transportation between the capital and Manhattan, the biggest city of Equestria, is essential for us to use in emergency cases. Resources and troops will flow quickly to assist our plans, and in peacetime, it'll allow for increased trade and easier transportation. Absolutely. Integration. 
Tons of building, 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 building is going on. I'm not leaving it this side just yet, but... This is a huge but. I'm going to keep these guys here just in case. You never know. You guys. Oh, another ship? Finally, another screen. Magical fire trading, I like that. <clears throat> so these two areas are going to be the main area we're going to contest everyone over here. Over here we might lose some stuff, but whatever. Ooh, lower the autonomy. To a demilitarized puppet. Hmm, that might not be good to do. We're going to do it anyways, though, because we can. More magical infantry. Uh, organization. What does this one do? Breakthrough? Oh, I need more breakthrough, yeah. Press censorship. Well, we don't really need to do that. Attacks from carriers. That'd be good. How much longer must we wait? Eight days. Naval department. Good. Chance for our guys to get hit. Let's reduce that. Yeah, we're actually going to get destroyed here. Carrier primacy, good. Probably Stallion Grad doesn't attack us. So, this is what we're going to do. I really don't trust the Crystal Empire. They're going to fall. Because they choose not to improve their infrastructure. And so because of that... I'm going to make sure that they fall. Good. Good enough for now. Rush over there, that's fine. Fine. We can have a little non aggression pact. And we find another operative of theirs. What's Nas Nestor's plan? Oh, land auction bonuses. Well, that's cool. The supply is just so bad here. Yeah, add some of these bad boys on there. We need them. That will help out, though. A tiny bit. Not much. But a little bit. The supply is bad down here, too. But part of it's because you're training. Economy, good. Select you guys first. Your naval bomber spitfires. God, I need more resources. Whatever. Should be good to go. We must ensure that everyone believes in the exact same thing as us. Of the 15, they've went to 5, and of course, the Republican no, but the Raffoni has quite a bit. Not a lot of manpower, a lot of manpower, not a huge amount, so that's good. Well, this is probably a bad idea, to be honest with you. Probably a terrible idea, but let's do it anyways. And. Good. Could we win up here? Good so far. I'm going to say yes for now. I'm going to say no because the line will fall apart. The line will absolutely fall apart. Hopefully they, the guys can move some stuff around there first. Are we out of equipment? I'm out of artillery. Whoops. That's fine. Whatever. We'll just build some more military factors real quick. Uh, 10%. Ooh, 70%. Not bad. 80. And then plop. One more. One more. Right there. Now oh, look at that. Just look at that. Beautiful. Next up, we shall do air combat tactics. For better performance in the air, we also need to focus on our aviation and doctrines. Victory goes to the side who controls the skies. Absolutely. And here, we're going to put some supply just in case. Good. Should have built some more stuff up there, guys. 
And when the tanks and Pegasuses will do more than fine. More than fine. Ooh, we actually own this. Great. Infrastructure for the masses. And for the masses, I mean the military. Oh, look at that. An encirclement. Now that's beautiful. There's a total of four divisions there. Professional training of application of magic. Ooh, that looks really good. Let's get this. Oh, the Pegasus is yes. Oh, look at that. The change just took that over. That's fine with me. That means I don't have to deal with it later. Smash room, smash room, smash room. Army department. Interrogation techniques. Improved radar. Yeah, y'all, y'all gonna need this. Good. Rocket shooting. I haven't encountered anything around here, which is good. We're definitely expanding well this way. Mark one decryption. Better radar, yes. Better planes, maybe. Good, we got a little more of this, so we're going to grab some logistics companies, and I will trade off that something else for uh, breakthrough companies and stuff like that. Can we just make a beeline for the... Oh my goodness, the capital's all the way up there. Take as much of the coast as you can. Alright, time to call the Crystal Empire in. It's a bad idea. Yeah, they're not coming in. Okay, changelings, well. As long as we still build up infrastructure, that's all that really matters to me. Losses, we've lost 6,000. Oh, that's pretty good. That is a lot of losses that we've got. Kill up people. Agent captured. No! Oh, crud, they're in the wrong places. Well, that sucks. Good. Build it up, build it up, build it up. Awesome. Oh, there you are. Are they going to attack? Yes, no, maybe so. Can we rescue the operative yet? Yes. Cancel lonely, that's fine. Take an export. Carrier task forces, good. Carrier organization and efficiency, that's really good. Stretching ourselves out a little thinly here. But we'll do the same thing here and actually concentrate our forces in the north. for secondary batteries, that's for later. Let's do that too. Yes, nice. Our soldiers are very, very strong. Shri strike back. Our bombers will make flights deep into enemy territory and demolish their industrial heartland. They shall know of our strength, but to achieve that, we must first improve our existing bomber models. Yes. Now the Pegasus Division, which is all the way over there, which really can't help us in the war ever too much if they're all the way down south. Upgrades, Applejack, you're doing a really good job. Oh, Ranger, nice. Good. Mark 1 encryption, awesome. Ballistic computers, look at that reliability. Minus 10%, no thank you, friend. No thank you. More resources, yeah. That'd probably be good. I guess when, maybe, in some locations, perhaps, yes. Maybe, yes. The penguins have not given up yet. Doing fine. I'm gonna beat it. And let's make sure we're continuing to build this area up. Infrastructure is so bad around here. I'm surprised we haven't found anything around here, but I guess it makes sense. 
The Republic of Nova Grifoni is going to be a pain in the butt to kill off, though. That is a little bit of my worry. Get some radar over here, too. Gotta help out. Nice. Beating him up. Beating him up. 37,000 losses. It's not bad. How much more manpower do they have? I got quite a bit. Pony power, I mean. I really don't want to raise my conscription level, but I will if I need to. Limit exports. Good. Nice. We got more resources, except for aluminum. Conscription crisis. Groups of conscientious objectors and pacifists have been trying to dodge the draft since the beginning of the war. But today, the situation has reached the breaking point. Large amounts of ponies are determined to avoid being sent to the front. If this situation is left alone, it may lead to serious pony power issues. It's a right to protest. Oh, good. Oh, God. Every pony needs a fight. Crack down on them so hard they won't think of dodging the draft again. Uh, every pony needs a fight. We'll be sort of middle ground-ish. Uncover forbidden magic. More air attack and armor. Uh, let's go with that one. Penguin land, yes. Supply base up here just in case, too. Good. Can you guys win here? Maybe? Advanced radar. Run and get some nukes, maybe. You might be able to win? No? Yes? Oh, no, Apple Jack Lagoon, that's not good. Could you stroll in on through here, perhaps? You might be able to just make a break for the capital, potentially. Great. Well, I've definitely made a mess of things. Oh, uh, yeah, go ahead and do that, that's fine. Good. And our soldiers are fighting extremely hard, especially our special force. But let's see how far... We just took the capital. Wait, what? Uh, wow. You went so far, you came back, you're going on a boat again. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, go there, maybe. I don't know. See what happens. Holy cow, that's kind of insane. I'm loving these tanks and this armor. They're... They're attacking a little bit too hard, in my opinion. Holy cow. Chill out, guys. Chill out. I know these are mountains. We're trying to avoid the mountains by going around this way, even though there's mountains up here, too, but... Relax. <laughs> Queen of the battlefield. Oh, hell yeah. Artillery is a desirable special sum pony for every soldier on the battlefield. We need to focus our research on modernizing our supported artillery. It is a key towards breaking enemy strongholds and morale. Absolutely. So, Sverdrup. That is probably the key to what we need. Sverdrup. We need to make tanks. What am I not making tanks for? We're only 20 combo with. What the heck? Do we have any spare armor? I got loads of spare armor. What? Oh, but that could hurt our supply right now. Let's go and stop making... Mm. That'll be fine for now. Yeah, the North is doing really well. I'm really proud of these guys. Really, really proud. Penguin land doing pretty well. The Republic of Nova Grifoni is going to be a pain in the butt, though. As we all know. A huge pain in the tuchus. You want to go that way. Capitulate them if you can. You guys probably won't be able to win, but you're here for a distraction. You might be able to help them out, actually, right there. Be careful, advance. We did it. We capitulated them. I love it. Go, go, go! Just don't die on the way over here. Good. Come on. Oh, we're actually doing really well now. Oh my goodness. I really don't want to sacrifice my soldiers, but sometimes a sacrifice is needed to win the war. But we will save that. For next time, hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we take out the Northern Block. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.